Welcome to another MedLook 4 tutorial. Today we will be discussing aging. When you upgrade a database from MedLook 3 to MedLook 4, the aging should take place during that upgrade. But let's say that you're new to MedLook 4 and you just want your aging to age on its own. You would come to the options menu and you would select and check the auto age on startup option. Now for small databases this is fine but for larger databases it could be a problem because the aging could take a few more seconds or up to a minute to complete and it would lengthen the startup time of the MedLook 4 program. But if you want to manually change aging you would come down and click on the click to edit aging button. So you click that and you get this small dialog. Now you have patient aging and insurance aging and you can change them both and they are completely separate from each other. And you have four choices to age by. You have date of service, date of entry, the first build date, or the last build date. So you just select whichever one you want I want to say date of entry for insurance aging and then to, com to complete it you just hit recalculate aging now for small databases it should not take very long at all but larger databases it could take a few seconds or maybe a minute so you hit OK, okay and the dialog disappears so you hit OK if you want auto aging on startup to be saved and there you go your charges will be aged on startup every time you run the MedLook 4 program. I hope this helps and have a nice day.